hey there guys welcome back to another ration review and today we have an american mre now this is menu number 12 elbow macaroni and tomato sauce and i'm not sure if i've tried this particular menu i might have i'm not sure but hey we're gonna try it yeah we'll get right to it we're gonna open it up we all know what the mre pouch looks like this one in particular is by the warnet company and that's all that really matters i'm not sure what year it's from but it should be you know relatively fresh let's open it up just gonna use the old method, which is, you know, brute force. Then we're in. All right, let's pull some things out. And the first thing we have is a Zappo sauce. And yeah, I like these pretty good. All right, we have a chocolate protein drink powder and looks like this MRE is from 2017. So yeah, very fresh. Very new. We have some regular cheese spread, not the jalapeno type, jalapeno. I like to say jalapeno. All right, we have some sour Skittles and yeah, my kids are gonna love these. We have an accessory packet and we'll check it out in a minute. MRE spoon. And here's our mains. We have the elbow macaroni and tomato sauce. Pretty hefty pouch. All right, we have a wheat snack bread. All right. And we have the very weak and almost useless American hot beverage bag. Um, yeah. And here's a cardboard sleeve for the mains. And we have a list of ingredients. If you wanna read it, go ahead and hit the pause button and nutrition facts. We have an American flameless ration eater. All right, so let's see what's inside of the accessory pack. We have cinnamon gum, Genio instant coffee. All right, we have some hot sauce, creamer, non-dairy dry, sugar, moist alette, iodized salt, butt ration, some matches. And that's it. All right, guys, there you have the entire content of the MRE, just in case you missed it. So let's begin. All right, let's heat up our mains. We're gonna use the standard FRH, so let's go. And we're gonna let this cook for about 15 minutes. All right, let's make some coffee. And we have this Genio instant coffee or freeze dried coffee. And of course, we're gonna use this enormous mug why not? Add some creamer. And some sugar. All right, let's check out this chocolate protein drink powder. Sounds kind of weird. I don't think I've tried this one before, so it should be the first time. All right, let's uh, add some water. Oh. 
close it back up. And give it a vigorous shake. All right, I think that's, um, that's good enough. Oh yeah, nice and clumpy. Yeah, it's very thick. There's clumps of uh, powder. All right, it looks like we didn't do a good job of mixing it, so we're just gonna give it another stir. That's probably as good as it's gonna get, so you know, let's move on. Let's give our coffee a try. There's our instant coffee, and here we go. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's a decent cup of coffee, uh, not as strong as your other MRE coffees, but it's very good, not bad. Let's try this chocolate protein caca drink. Here we go. Mm. Oh, wow. Wow, that is not bad at all. That's actually pretty good. Really nice chocolate flavor, very thick and creamy, nice and sweet. That actually surprised me. It's actually really good. Give it another try. Mm. Oh yeah, that's good. All right, let's break out our old forgotten friend. Our MRE tray. Welcome back. All right, we have the wheat snack bread. Can't go wrong with the wheat snack bread sometimes. There you have it. Just looks like a uh, wannabe slice of bread. So let's just give it a try. There we go. Yeah, very soft, a little bit chewy, just a hint of sweetness. coffee mm, yeah. all right let's um let's check out the cheese spread or uh, cheese whiz whatever you want to call it same thing there's our cheese spread let's give it a try mm. And that is just cheese whiz, which means very processed cheese. Let's make a little cheesy buddy. There's our cheesy buddy. Let's um, let's give it a try. That cheese spread goes really well with the bread. I would even go as far as saying uh, that's better than the crackers. All right, we're gonna try the zapple sauce and we have some ingredients, which are apples, high fructose corn syrup, maltodextrin, sugar, water, exorbic acid, vitamin C and that's pretty much it let's open it up comes in this neat package which you can just uh, eat right out of so I'll give it a try and there you have it looks just like applesauce here we go And the flavor is just like applesauce, same texture, same type of sweetness, maybe a little bit sweeter, but yeah, it's all the same. All right, so we're already at the mains. Let's get it out. Should be nice and hot. Yeah, that is nice and hot. Let's open it up. 
There's our elbow macaroni and tomato sauce. It does look really good. I'm not gonna lie. All right, let's, uh, let's check this out. And there we have the elbow macaroni. We have chunks of tomato. We have some herbs and that's pretty much it. Let's give it a try. Check that out. And yeah, that does look really nice. All right, here we go. Ooh, that's hot. Mm. That is surprisingly tasty. The tomato sauce is really good. It has a really strong herb flavor. The pasta is a little bit on the mushy side, a little bit overcooked, but overall it's uh, it's really decent. It's really good. All right, let's kick it up a notch. Add some of this hot sauce. Throw some here. And some of this cheese spread. And we might as well try it with the snack bread. Just break off a piece. All right, there we have it. Snack bread, cheese bread, and elbow macaroni and tomato sauce with hot sauce. There we go. Mm. Oh, wow. Wow, that's really good. Mmm. I am actually very surprised. That is excellent. The combination of the cheese and the hot sauce with the tomato sauce is excellent. The hot sauce gives it a really nice kick. The cheese spread gives it that cheesiness, gives it a wonderful flavor. That is a really good combination. Definitely a winner. And we have the sour Skittles. Nothing much to them, just Skittles with a little bit of a tartness, a little bit of a sour flavor. And you can see the sour coating, that little white layer. All right, let's try it. And those are simply Skittles with a little bit of sourness, a little bit of tartness. Those are perfect for my kids. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. This was the Elbow Macaroni and Tomato Sauce menu number 12 from 2017. And I must say, I am really surprised. I really enjoyed that chocolate protein drink. It's almost like pudding, like liquid pudding. The Elbow Macaroni with the cheese spread and hot sauce was just amazing. I really enjoyed this one. It was a solid MRE. So that being said, I would have to give it a 7.5 out of 10. It's a must try. The Elbow Macaroni and that chocolate drink alone is worth it trust me but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did please hit that thumbs up and subscribe and make sure you hit the little notification bell and you'll be notified as soon as any content is available yeah i just want to give everyone a huge thanks a huge thanks to my patrons as well i really appreciate your support and as always thank you guys for watching see you soon